Hi right, guys, Rick Marano here. This is Columbusville River Park. Nice little place to come take your kids and even go kayaking. Excuse the noise in the background, just a little bit of traffic. And they actually closed us down for a little bit and did some, uh, as you can say, some new landscaping and stuff. They made a trailway where you can walk down over here. And down over there is the Bill River. Quite a neat little place. Come here and have a little picnic with your family. Take your dogs. Of course, gotta make sure they're on leash and stuff. Don't see no signs where it says you can have your dogs or anything, but always be responsible, of course, with your dogs and things like that. Nice little tree there. And benches to sit down at. And down there, what you see is the Bill River. I'll walk down this way because it's a little easier than going down that steep step over there. Or to my right. There are fish in here, I'm not sure what type there are, but alright, it's a small game fish and stuff like that. Hard to say. Well, this water used to be much clearer at one point in time. Certain areas where it's clear. Not quite sure how deep it is, but it's probably maybe six feet deep right now at the moment. Pretty quiet as you see. Like I said, there's traffic behind me. It's like a main road behind me. Hope you guys are enjoying your day. Right here, it looks like they made a little rocks that you can walk down. I haven't done a video around, so I figured I'd do a video here. Not sure how far the Bell River goes pretty far. I know it goes underneath the highway, the main highway, uh, I 94, east and west. On the other side of there, you can see some of the forests, some of the nice, beautiful trees, aspen trees. I think there's some birch trees over there somewhere. But I hope you guys are doing the rest of your summer and getting ready for fall. I guess uh, there's a main uh, drag behind this, it's called Gratiot Avenue. This is in Columbus, Michigan. Small little city, not far from Richmond or New Haven or Lenox. Not sure how many people on. And up there you can see the sun. And behind me, clouds. Like I said, hope everybody's doing good. It's a nice and quaint place. Great place to take the kids. Just come rest and relax and have a barbecue. I haven't been here in a while since they've done the Real landscaping. Looks like they did a pretty good job. I believe there's a trail you can follow. I'm not going to follow it today though. But maybe one day I'll get out there and follow it. And it looks like this is a, where you can take your boat down to. I'm not for sure though if you're allowed. Maybe at one point in time. Looks like you can. I mean this is where they release fish in two. Take the boats. Hard to say. What else is there? Well, not much else to say, except I will try to bring you more videos as much as possible. It has been very hectic in my life right now. I'm walk down this way just a little bit. I think you guys already seen a little bit of this already. Sorry, I gotta raise my voice up a little bit louder. Like I said, I'll bring you some videos as much as I can as possible. These are things I like to do. I don't do it for profit or nothing. I just do it because I enjoy it. And I see how people enjoy it. I see some of my videos. And also I like to do historic things, things like that, and nature. Places to visit in Michigan. Looks like there's some flowers over there. Let's see if I can zoom in a little bit. On the river behind me. In front of me, actually. Sorry, it's a little bumpy, let me screw it out a little bit. Hope all is well with you people. And all the other subscribers out there, thank you. If you guys like my channel, like and subscribe at Herkimer at Random at YouTube.com. Appreciate all my subscribers and look forward to many more to come. The nice big trees right here. 
Look at that. That's just great. That's nature at its best. And I think there's more trail down here you can walk. I'm going to walk down this way a little bit more and see. I watch out for mosquitoes over here, of course. <laughs> See, I've seen any wildlife, but there are wildlife out here. We do have fox here in Michigan, just a red fox. That's the only fox we have. No other. My wife's back over there in the car, sitting down with our in law dogs. Not sure how far the trail goes now, but they did knock a lot of down. Uh, stuff down so you can walk through here. This was not like this before. As you can see, that they left a lot of branches off. I don't know if there's any more walkway down here or not. We'll take a peek and look. A light pole for nighttime. Some people walking at night. This park's open from dawn to dusk, so when it starts getting a little dark out, you gotta obviously leave when it gets to dusk. And yes, it is patrolled. And right here, really gotta be careful right here, it looks like. There's a walkway pathway down here. It's pretty steep, so you gotta be pretty careful. Now my wife should not be able to do it. my wife would not be able to do this, but I can. The skills are biting, gotta be careful. A little rocky. <laughs> Very steep also. Oh, I have to get out of here real quick because there's way too many mosquitoes over here actually. They're already biting at me. No, that's like I said, that's Bell River. It goes all the way from underneath I-94. East and West comes down from over by East China Chinatown Township, I believe. So it's a pretty long river. I'm not sure where it ends. I think I want to say it ends in Romeo, Michigan. I'm not quite sure. Or Clinton Township. It's pretty quiet. Like I said, there are fish in here. I'm not quite sure what kind of fish there are. But as you can see, there are things here, and obviously oh, you can hear some of the wildlife. So for now, guys, thanks for watching my channel. If you like my channel, Kirk Mart Random at YouTube.com, please like and subscribe. Hit that notification bell button. Thank you. Have a great day. Bye.